Welcome back to another Secrets of the Pros. And I want to shout out to all the fans, all the subscribers. Keep it coming. And uh, be sure to hit me up on YouTube on my website. Link in the description. www.pristineproduction.website.com And uh, today we got a very special treat. I'm going to be talking about Isotope RX8 Advanced Audio Editor. And this is the magic box here where you can make acapellas, you can uh, rip vocals from tracks, you can make instrumentals, and you can export them, make a stem from a single file, and audio repair. You know, so uh, we can do some repair stuff on it. And the instrumental right now is an example of a track that I, I took out. Uh, vocal track I took out I made an instrumental and this thing is a beast but well, I'm gonna go into the uh, options here so let's get right into it here now first I want to talk about uh, two features here we have a lot here we have the guitar uh, guitar denoise here take off those fret noise and and you know those stuff you hear on, on guitars so um but I'm gonna pay attention to all. We have mount the click. We have uh, dialog isolate. Uh, we have D win a lot of stuff. But here are the, the, the two guys here: music rebalance and uh, spectral recovery and spectral re repair. Example of that. Let me see if I can uh, if I can take off. Not sure why that is th that's doing that, but okay. So, what is the spectral uh, repair here? Now, example: I have a uh, piece of audio here that I recorded with some rain sounds in it. It's a stereo audio file, and there's a little frog in this thing, and. This is the magic right here. You can use RX8 to take out certain noises in the no in, in the track in the frequency uh, through what they call you know artificial uh, algorithm here. So I'm gonna play this here, and then you can hear that little toad making a little noise. You know, um, people might cool with it, but let's say we want to find that sound. Uh, first of all, what we want to do, we want to change the view here uh, to the uh, waveform uh, spectrogram opacity. So on the lower left corner here, I'm going to take my little slider. We have waveform spectral opacity. I'm going to drag that uh, left click. I'm going to drag it to the right. Then you can see Isotope RX-8 is... Um, Revealing some more here. We're seeing less than uh, less uh, of the waveform and more of what's really going on in this audio here. So if I go ahead and take a look, there we can see these little uh, lines here: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. These this is noise of the frog. Um, I'm gonna play here, and there you can see when that gap comes, you don't hear it when you hear it again. So that's obviously the frog. So how do we do that? Well, first of all, we have to make sure we're in uh, this mode here. Remember, I can go to the left. If you want to see the normal waveform, or we go to slide it to the right, where we can get a little bit more audio surgery going on here. So I already know this area right here is the sound of the frog. So I'm going to go ahead and click on my little lasso Photoshop tool here. People say RX-8 is like Photoshop for audio. And I'm going to drag and make a little selection here around that frog. So this is the area that we want to isolate here. And we have more over here as well. But I'm using this part here as an example. So I'm going to go down to Spectral Repair, and I'm going to click on that. And there is uh, this little option that comes up, Spectral Repair here. Um, 
we have attenuate which is generally your go-to you want to do if you want to when it comes to removing um, noise that might be bothering you in your recording we have replace which uh, deals with a different kind of algorithm here that scans the surround sounds around the main sound a pattern um, partial noise as well but uh, we're going to use attenuate for this one we have this uh, the, the strength the strength here uh, which uh, intensify how much of that sound is, is is removed and you know leaving more or less um, a frequency texture behind or bleed so and the great thing about RX8 is gonna give you a sample before you make a decision so I'm gonna go down here to compare and I'm gonna left click he brings up a little box this is the original audio. I can preview the original audio here. <laughs> we can hear the little frog. Now this is the first settings right here. So I'm going to preview what the, what that will sound like. Now you can bear, barely hear that little frog, which you might want to you know want to use if you want to back off on the strength i can do that and i can go to compare it has another uh, version here on the fly let's do that so it brings a little bit more of the rain i can increase the strength all the way and do another version and, and you can good you can do this until you get the results that you want it's a little bit too much but you get the idea so you can remove here's the here's the original audio and here is when we attenuate it so very very handy very handle very handy tool there with this and you can experiment with tracks you know vocal recording all that stuff so that's the main most of the main thing people's going to use this thing for when it comes to spectral repair, uh, repair, I'm gonna come out of that, and also spectral recovery is similar uh, to to that, uh, where you, you you can dampen noise, and uh, you know spectral uh, patching as well. If I can do a little bit of preview here, see if I can get something. Uh, it it will try and listen to the noise. And then um, it's gonna try and and fix you up. The other tool I, I'm not gonna spend too long on. Um, I'm not gonna spend too long on this. The other tool I wanted to show you. I'm, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna quit at this part here. We already understand how do we get to that. We we remove the slider here on the, on the bottom left corner. We go to the the spectral. A spectrogram so we can see a little bit more of the auto on the on the lower right corner here I can I can zoom in and I can see a little bit more the audio that I'm that I'm targeting here and then when we're ready to do that we can make the selection and click on the spectral uh, repair now the other one I want to talk about is I'm gonna slide this to the left here is the music rebalance here so i'm going to play the original track Summers. that i took the vocals from here we go and this is the singer uh, agent warren Now, RX8 has uh, turned it up to another level here. I'm going to click on Music Rebalance right over here. And here you have the options now to solo each part. I can solo the vocal, the bass, the percussions, and the other in instrument stuff. And you can get a preview of each, uh, each of that. And you can t uh, select the quality. Um, best is going to work a little bit longer, but give you a more accurate a more accurate uh, result um, I went ahead and did a pre-process here so I'm gonna give you the example 
uh, so uh, so it, you don't wait too long. The separation knob is how much it's going to separate uh, the vocal from the audio source or isolate the bass. So the more you, you push in, you might get to isolate the sound more, but kind of introduce a little bit of texture and bleed. I'm sorry. So I'm going to give you the version. And also, the new feature is here to separate, if you see here, output stems into separate uh, tracks, ignoring gain control. So it is going to create a stem file, break it up in four from one track. So an example here, I went ahead and took down all the faders. I didn't use the, the stem feature. And I went ahead and render. Of course, you can preview this to hear what it sounds like. I went ahead and render it so it just have the vocals. And, and this is what I uh, came up with here. Let's, 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 let's um, play it back. So you can hear RX8 preserve the vocals and the reverb. This is cool. That sounds amazing. You know, I'm, I'm hearing nice quality here. And uh, they've mm, taken this thing me. to another level. Give me everything I need. And I can take this and uh, remix my version. Which is very good for um, live music. Love like you know. Let's see what it sounds like when she hits the chorus. Nice. And I went ahead and did the same music rebalance here again. And instead of leaving the vocals, you know, I put everything back to zero. And this time we want to take out the vocals and leave just the instrumental. Or you can leave just the bass and that stuff. And uh, this is what I came up with. No vocals, and we have the instrumental. You can hear the keyboards intact and all of that stuff. Which is so amazing, guys. So uh, that's Isotope RX-8 in action, Advanced Audio Editor. And uh, remember to support me, guys. Hit me up. On YouTube at my website, uh, www.pristineproduction.webstars.com. Check out my courses on mixing from start to finish in the box. Uh, support my website. Buy my uh, sample loops. If you want me to mix and master for you, I can do that at reasonable prices. So I'll catch you guys on the next one. <laughs>